Medical technology has advanced with mankind. Development of science and civilization has led to development of medical technology and treatments for various diseases have been developed to improve the quality of human life. However, degenerative diseases still remain as tasks to be solved. Degenerative arthritis especially is a serious disease that reduces seniors' quality of life and is widely known to result in cartilage that cannot be regenerated once damaged. Joint stem technology of damaged cartilage regeneration. Joint stem, a stem cell treatment, treated with just a single injection. Overcoming the limits of medicine and surgical operation. Stem cell, the next generation treatment with no age limit and no immune rejection response. Innovation beyond novelty. A new global standard of treatment for degenerative arthritis. Joint stem, an autologous adipose stem cell treatment. Until now, there haven't been many ways to treat degenerative arthritis. The best way was to use medications like pain relievers, anti-inflammatory drugs, and joint lubricants to alleviate pain while waiting for the cartilage to wear out. The joints were then replaced with artificial joints in the late phase of the disease. Because damaged cartilage cannot regenerate on its own, Arthritis patients in early and middle phases had to wait until their joints were completely worn out. But what if damaged cartilage could be regenerated? Under the approval of the Korean Ministry of Food and Drug Safety in March 2009, the world's first clinical test was carried out on degenerative arthritis patients for the development of autologous adipose stem cell injection. This clinical test was to evaluate the safety and effectiveness of joint stem, the stem cell treatment, which was injected into the glenoid cavity of knee coxarthritis patients. The result was astonishing. Mesenchymal stem cells, separated from the patient's subcutaneous fat, were injected into the knee joint, and as a result the joint functions were improved and damaged cartilage was regenerated. The effect of cartilage regeneration was shown to be greater with a larger number of stem cells injected. According to the researchers, the degree of exposure of bones caused by worn cartilage was reduced by 64% in six months after injection of joint stem. The research result was not only published on stem cells, the most authoritative journal of stem cells in the world, but also at a special session of Game Changers at the largest international orthopedics conference. Joint stem was spotlighted as an innovative therapeutics that can bring a paradigm shift in the next few years. Joint stem has already completed clinical phase one and phase two in Korea, and it is the world's first stem cell treatment to be exempted from clinical phase one by the US FDA and receive an approval of clinical phase two. Clinical phase three was recently approved in Korea. How is this treatment possible? Stem cell is considered to be the last hope for incurable diseases. Stem cell refers to a blast cell in the body that can transform into different cells. In other words, it can differentiate into any kind of cell and plays a role in recovering functions of inactive cells. Autologous cartilage cell implantation is the current method of cartilage recovery and it is widely performed in Europe and the United States. This is a method in which healthy cartilage tissue is extracted from the patient and is re-implanted to the damaged region. However, there are limits to the implantation due to the risk of having to extract healthy cartilage and go under operation twice. The number of cartilage cells re-implanted is only about 10 million. As people grow older, the number of stem cells decreases in organs, resulting in reduced regeneration ability and healing power. 
However, JointSTEM is acknowledged for the excellent patented cultivation technology that secures a sufficient number and high activity of cells regardless of the patient's age. Furthermore, only a few milliliters of fat tissue is required to cultivate stem cells. Compared to the fact that only tens of millions of stem cells can be obtained using cord blood, the technology in which hundreds of millions of stem cells are cultivated from a small amount of adipose tissue is unprecedented in the world. In addition, we are proud to present joint stem's groundbreaking advantage, completely differentiated from existing treatments, as cartilages are sufficiently regenerated by a single injection without surgery. Stem cells were used as an auxiliary means to regenerate cartilages after making holes in bones, but joint stem is the very first method that succeeded in cartilage regeneration with a simple one-time injection. Nonetheless, safety must take the highest priority when applying new medical technologies. Joint stem, with stem cells separated and cultivated from one's own adipose tissue, is a safe therapeutics that fundamentally cannot show an immunological rejection response. Stem Cells Journal published a paper in 2014 on joint stem's clinical result on degenerative arthritis. It verified that there are no side effects involved with joint stem. A clinical paper on spinal cord injury published by Stem Cells and Development Journal in 2011 also showed that there were no side effects when a large number of adipose stem cells was injected into blood vessels. These studies confirm the fact that joint stem is extremely safe. Alzheimer's. 어, 전 세계의 어, 그 난치병, 실병 환자가 자기 자신의 줄기세포를 이용해서 어, 정말 어, 건강하게 에, 이 사회에 에, 그 봉사하고 기여하면서 어, 건강한 삶을 누릴 수 있도록 기여하는 데 저희의 에, 비전이 있겠습니다. Because stem cell is regulated as medicine in Korea, strict clinical tests and quality control are essential. We have the world's largest stem cell production center that undergoes a quality control process to guarantee safety. An innovative medicine that uses safe autologous cells, pain relief, improvement of joint functions, and cartilage regeneration, all accomplished by a single injection a global standard to open up a new era of regenerative medicine. Revolution. Regeneration. Recreation. Joint stamp an autologous adipose stem cell medicine for degenerative arthritis.